If you are looking for a new golf car, you may wonder which is right for you, gas or electric power. Once you decide between gas and electric, you need to determine which voltage is best for you. 48 volts versus 72 volts. To help you avoid the same obstacle as in the county, I have analyzed 48 and 72 volt golf car from different aspects. We help you determine which model best suits for your needs and budget. Why does voltage matter? Before we explain the pros and the cons of 48 volts versus 70 volts golf cup, it is important to know why voltage matters. From a technical standpoint, voltage is the potential difference in charge between two points in an electric field. The greater the voltage, the greater the current. This means the higher of the battery voltage, the longer of the run time. Pros of a 48 volt golf car easily converts into a hunting vehicle or overall budget. Battery replacement costs less compared to a 72 volt golf car. Has higher resale value than a 36 volt golf car. Cons of a 48 volt golf car. Less runtime range than a 72 volt golf car. Batteries can be expensive to replace. Replacement motors are typically on the more expensive side. Pros of a 72 volt golf car. We charge fast with a high capacity 1500 volt charger. Regenerating braking allows a longer drive with the family, much longer runtime than a 48 volt system. More torque with power and efficiency. Cost of a 72 volt golf car. Battery replacement are more expensive, more battery to remain regularly. While 72 volt golf car both are much power, range, efficiency, and parts and general upkeep can drain your wallet. If you're looking for a ride that has enough power but is less expensive, the 48 volts may be all that you need. If you are okay with investing in your next golf car, however, the 72 volt just might be your next ride. If you are currently in the market for a new golf car battery, you can check it out at the website below to find the battery you need. Thank you for watching. Bye.